Hey you guys, it's Peter, and I'm back. Of course I'm back, I'm not going anywhere. We're YouTube famous now. We're YouTube famous, be, be both of us. You and me, and he said, well, mostly me, I got the painting. Did you get a painting? I don't think so. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? He said, no, I wanna sit in your lap, daddy. Well, you can't. And I'll tell you why people can't sit on my lap today. Do you see, I have my red on and my pink on for Valentine's Day. I haven't really gotten ready for the day. I just kind of threw on some clothes. I'm doing laundry and I had to go to the P.O. box and all that kind of stuff. And let me tell you, I was, oh my God, I was so excited when I went to the P.O. box today, you guys. Now listen, I went yesterday and you guys were so nice to me. I got all kinds of Valentine's Day cards in the mail and gift cards and stuff. I loved it so much. But anyway, let me tell you what happened today. I couldn't believe it. So, okay, if you guys don't have a post office box, what happens is if you go to the post office and you open your post office box, mine is about that big, okay? And real long. <laughs> anyway, but um, so the, <laughs> that was kind of a good joke, actually. So anyway, um, but what won't fit in there, like if they're books and stuff, they don't typically put them in there. Letters, they'll like manila envelopes and things like that, they'll kind of fold over. But if they don't fit in there, then you get a key. It's like a scavenger hunt, right? And then the key goes to another box, like a bigger box, and then you go open that. I always get number 51, I don't know why. But anyway, then you go to that box and there's like different sizes of boxes, so like, or different sizes of like uh, post office boxes. So when you get there, you know, like, oh my God, like it's either like a box that's like this big or it's like a big, huge box. And you're like, oh my God, what did I get? A brand new computer? I would love. So anyway, or maybe keys to a Range Rover, but those would fit in my other box. So anyway, I got to my post office box today. And since I got so much stuff yesterday, I honestly didn't think I would get anything today. And I opened it and there was a key in there. And I was like, oh my God. And I went and it was like to one of the bigger boxes. I was like, what is going on here? So I was like, I went and... Oh, I got my next cheapo box. I was so excited. And um, so they had contacted me. I don't know if you guys have seen my previous view, my previous video that I did unboxing the cheapo box. I did it a couple months ago. I'll link the video uh, below. Um, and I had so much fun working with them. Um, the cheapo box people are so nice. They're just like one of the nicest, like, okay, on my booktube channel, I do a lot of unboxings. Alex and I have done a couple like Asian treat unboxings on here and some other things. I love subscription boxes so much. You guys know that, right? And so when they reached out to me a couple months ago and they were like, would you do a review of our subscription box? I was like, yeah, of course. And I was super, super excited about it. Um, and they were saying, well, we'll like maybe pay you a little bit of money if you're interested in that. This is not a sponsored video. Um, so anyway, I was like, no, don't worry about it. Just send me the box. I just want to see what the, what's in the box. And the thing that's really cool about the cheapo box, okay, is that the value is about $20 and it costs $20, all right? And the thing is, is that everything that you get, they personally select based on these questions that you answer. So you like go in and you take this test and you answer these questions and then they go in and they like specifically get you things and put it in your box that are like just for you. And what's so weird about that is you would think that like, um, I'm making sure I have my scissors. What you would think is weird about that is that like, you would think that like some of this stuff is like really off, like how to, but it's like almost like going to a psychic that's like right on, like they know exactly like what you want. And it's so weird, like last time, they got me so, I mean, I, if you watched my last video, you know what I'm talking about. Like, they were like so on point. And so I was like, when they contacted me again, and they didn't do a Christmas box, and then they contacted me again, and they were like, do you want to do the Valentine's Day box? I was like, of course, I love Valentine's Day. So anyway, this is the Valentine's Day cheapo box. I'm so excited about it. I have my scissors. Let's just cut right into this thing and uh, open it up. They're not real big on their packaging. That's the one thing I will say is like, I mean, they're just not really big on their, it's just basically a box. Um, I, I think it's like a husband and wife or something that like, I think they live in Kentucky somewhere and they're like, just like, I don't know, out of their apartment and they just put these boxes together, but God love them. So anyway, okay. Oh my God. So you open the box and this is what it looks like. It is like literally packed to the brill. Okay. And, um, with tissue paper, I love when, um, I love when subscription boxes are like really personalized and they always include a personal letter, which I think is so cool, right? I mean, like they hand write it, you see? Okay, so, and I don't wanna look, I'm super excited, but they have like all this tissue paper and stuff in here. Okay. Sorry, I didn't understand the question I heard. 
Okay, Peter, happy V-Day. Thank you so much for your continued interest in the Cheapo Box. After carefully evaluating your content, as well as your likes and dislikes, we have created this Valentine's Day Cheapo Box edition especially for you. Please um, place the included code under your video for your viewers to gain an extra 1.5% off their next box valued at only $20. Much love, Cheapo Box Incorporated. Okay, so like that's their little personal letter. But you can tell, I mean like they legit, like, see? It says at the top, like, dear Peter. So anyway, I think that's really cool. All right, PP's like so excited. He's like, what did you get? All right, I love presents, first of all. I won't lie. So I'm just gonna take, I don't wanna look. I don't wanna see. <laughs> okay. So the first thing that the cheap, that is in the cheap about here, I'll just show you guys. This is so funny. You can, you just open it. It's like all right there. So the first thing that's in my cheapo box is a snake, right? And they know that I constantly, uh, <laughs> Like, this was one of the questions. They're like, have you met a lot of interesting people on YouTube? And I was like, I actually have. I've met a lot of snakes. So I think that's so cute that they remembered that and they put that on there. Oh, look. Coming for the beauty gurus. So they put a snake in there. That is so funny. They're so cute. Okay. And then um, I said some of those same snakes, their channel seems to just be like going down. They might need a job in a while. So they sent me a for rent sign. Wasn't that so nice to send to those old friends of mine so they can become rent children, rent boys and girls. All right. Okay, let's see what's next. You guys are going to die. I don't know how they knew I was out of this. Like, seriously? Like, I cannot believe... I wonder if they like watched some of my videos. I do not know how they knew that I was out of blue nail polish, but listen, I was going to go get some anyway, so I am so excited for this. And you guys, you know where this belongs, don't you? I mean, if you are long time, big watchers, woof, woof, woof pack, you know where we watch the, where we put this, right? We put this right up here. Oh look, I'm knocking snakes all over the world. Okay, <laughs> swing that snake around like they do everybody else. All right. Oh my God, look at this. PP is so excited about, I can't, I have. Now you guys know, I love the show, Bring It On, and I love Dance Moms, okay? <gasps> Do you even know what they got me? Hold on, I have to use my scissors. I'm so excited. This is so hilarious. They did totally, PP is like so excited. Do you see this? Look at him. He's like, what is going on, dad? What's in there, dad? They like totally nailed this. Look, do you guys see this? Look at him. He's like, dad, I want an El Cheapo box. What is it, PP? Look. <laughs> no. Scissors are not for play. He is like digging legit in the box. PB, no. Oh, there must be. Ooh, Lord, no, 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 no. Somebody said in one of my videos the other day in the comment section, how many chins do you have? Many. Okay. DD for L. DD for L. I wanted to be a cheerleader so bad, but. That was back when they didn't like boys being cheer guards. Now they're all over and they're really good looking. Ooh. All right, so those are really hot. I like those. <laughs> we'll just put this right over those snakes because those snakes could use some new hair anyway. All right, look. Oh, blue, just like the nail polish. Oh my God. So you guys know, like, I am obsessed with the poopy de chiffon. And what's so funny is if you guys... I don't know what you don't know is a lot, that in my last unboxing, they were actually the ones that sent me the Poopy de Chiffon, okay? The Poopy de Chiffon doll that always sits right over there. So let me tell you what they sent me this time. This is so funny. <laughs> I'm a little old for some of this stuff, but they sent me a puny Poopy. Oh my God. And there she is, doll furniture, Mubla's de Poopy. And there she is. And she's got a little desk and a little chair and there she's gonna sit on her chair. She's gonna put her little laptop and she's gonna film her movies. And then whenever you see Poopy up there filming her movies, what you'll know is she's up to no good. Okay, look at that. There she is. She's filming her videos. She didn't even sit in that chair. How's she gonna do this? Look at that. Blue nail polish behind her, just like somebody else I know. Girl, you're all set to be a beauty guru drama channel. All right, let's go on. Let's see what's next. That was so sweet. Moobliz the poopy. Moobliz. Now, if y'all got the poopy doll before and you named her poopy the chiffon because you know I love her so much, okay, then you have to go get the poopy uh, furniture as well. So, all right. You guys, this is so funny. So, if you watch my videos, I have mentioned on here many times 
that like I am not good at math, okay? And that like I failed math miserably in high school. And they like must have taken that seriously. There were like a couple questions about that on there. They were like, what were your best subjects in high school? It was like, I don't know, it was like English was my best, math was my worst. This is so sweet of them, so if they can help me like with my math, listen. They got me frozen early math basic geometry because I said that I cheated on my final exam in geometry, which was total truth. Points and segments, basic shapes. I know lots of basic shapes. Drawing and printing and symmetry. I, I love symmetry. Look at this. Oh my God. Have fun working with your child. Read all the directions for your child and help him guide. Okay, point, line, and segment. Let me point out what a point is. A point is just one certain place in space, one teeny spot. This is real confusing. Okay, we'll just come back to that later. Oh my lord, a present for Pee Pee and I! It's tea time with Pee Pee! It's gonna be a new segment on here, Pee Pee, look. We're gonna have tea time. Oh, he's so excited. He, he's so excited. Look, he's like, what is it, Dad? It's tea time with Pee Pee! They specifically wrote on the back, they said, this is for tea time with Pee Pee, okay. Pee -pee, I can't. Pee -pee, oh my god! Hold on here. I'm gonna put this over the box. If I don't, we're gonna lose all of our tea. Time. <gasps> a little tea kettle. And then little, little plates. Little plates for little eaters like Pee Pee. You don't bite the plate, Pee Pee. That's bad for you. Okay. Do you take cream or sugar in yours? You take cream? Okay, I put the cream. All right there. And then I don't take mine, I take mine strong and hot like my man. Okay, and then here we go, Pee Pee. <laughs> this is so much fun for a 44 year old man to have tea times with his dog. <laughs> okay. All right, Pee Pee, let's go. <laughs> oh, well, we all gotta have fun and be a little foolish, don't we? Okay. Oh, this is so funny. I know where they got this one. Lollipop, lollipop, oh, lolly, 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 lollipop. Ba -dum, bum, bum. You guys, I do this on my video all the time. And I love the lollipop gang. If I was going to be in the Wizard of Oz, I think I would want to be one of the members of the lollipop. The lollipop girl, the lollipop girl. And in the name of the lollipop girl. Oh my God, I got my own tiara. This is like a starter kit. <laughs> These are junk. Anyway, okay, this is so much fun. I can't believe they got me my own tiara. I did remind them in there, I said, don't ever forget when Shane Dawson said that Peter was the king of YouTube, and the king of YouTube is the one that should be wearing a crown or <laughs> tiara. Anyway, all right, let's see. Oh my God, jewels! The jewels of the Nile. And in the name of the lollipop girl. Okay. Now. Mm. Okay. Face masks. Mask pour la visage. Which translated means there's a lot of stink on YouTube. So you might want to wear one of these masks. So that way when you're doing the YouTubes. It doesn't stink so bad. Okay. Oh my god, and then look, they got me candy and it says keep calm and take a selfie. So I think I will. I'll put it on Snapchat. <laughs> oh lord, Peepy, you want to be in my video? You want to be in my selfie? Oh my lord. Okay, listen. <laughs> I'm going to put on here. Filming a video. <laughs> do, 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 Take a selfie just like I did. <laughs> this is so much fun. Oh my God, that is so good. It's like hot in here. It's getting hot in here. Oh, so take off all your clothes. I am getting so hot. I'm gonna take my clothes off. Now, one of the things they asked me specifically about was that I joke in a lot of my videos, you guys know I do, about coochie. And I'm always like, you know my coochie itches, or this hot, blah, 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 whatever. I always say the word coochie, right? Or her coochie smells. I said that about Lena Dunham the other day. They were so nice to spend me some feminine hygiene spray. Oh my God, that is so hilarious. PP, this is, let's, okay, I have never been that close to a badge, so let's just smell it. Personal care, okay. Directions, shake well. Hold an eight to 12 inches away 
and spray the entire external vaginal area. So basically you'd be like, shh, oh, I feel so much better. Okay. To extend the fresh, clean feeling, lightly spray on panty liners, undergarments, or anything that you wear close to your body. <laughs> These are kind of like panty liners. Anyway. Oh well, well thanks. Now every time I talk, I talk about the word cooch, you know I'm bringing this one out. Maybe should we eat a chocolate? Should we have one of these keep, keep calm and take a selfie chocolate? Let's see what's inside of here. Okay. I, now listen, I don't like the strawberry fillings, pee pee. I don't like the caramels. This is like about the cheapest candy box I've ever seen. Oh, it's a cheapo box. Does it say on the back of it like which one is which? Cause I don't, okay. Strawberry cream, I don't like those. Cocoa, truffle, orange cream. I wonder what orange cream tastes like. Let's try that one. No, PB. Mm, it's kind of tart. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh no, ma'am. Oh, wow, horrible. I don't like sours, and now we can add to the list. I don't like orange creams. Okay. Okay, there's one last thing in here. I'm so excited. I was just talking the other day in one of my videos about how I need a new cologne. And every cheapo box, they specifically pick out a hot, like, a specifically, like, really cool up-and-coming cologne or perfume just for you, depending on if you're a man or a woman or, you know, whatever you want to wear. So if you're a man that likes to wear women's perfume, or you just put that in there and they explain it. Whatever. So, okay. And a lot of women wear men's cologne, too, so you can put that in there. For me, I am so excited it says in here, compare to, I can't read it because I need my readers, Hot Thrills! Oh my lord! I've heard so many good things about this. Actually, I really have. Like, if you guys have not heard of this, this is like one of the most expensive colognes out right now. Hot Thrills. Okay, let's see. Um, I think I might be regifting that one. <laughs> Thank you, Cheapo Box Fit. French whores in a church on Sunday, baby. Oh, that is strong. That is like really strong. Shoot, and I gotta go run errands. Okay, so cheap hot thrills <laughs> and cheap skills. <laughs> anyway, so that is <laughs> that is my Cheapo Box this year. For Valentine's Day. Oh, that cologne is strong. <sighs> oh no, now I know when you stink why you need this. Oh my lord. Whoo! Oh my lord. Okay. Well, that's my cheapo box for Valentine's Day. It's a little late to get the Valentine's Day one. They might have some discounted ones on there if you guys want. They do do a St. Patrick's Day one. I saw it on the website when I was uh, like picking out and answering my questions. So you guys can go on there and I will list the um, website below. Please go check it out. If you use the special code that I've included, you also get um, an extra 1.5% off your Cheapo box, which is $20 valued at $20. So it's a really good deal, you guys. It's really cool, it's personalized. You know, it's really fun. It's a fun subscription box. Um, it's not my favorite, but I would probably get a four out whoo! I would probably give it a four out of five stars. I would have given it a five out of five stars. This kind of fan thing is kind of cool. I might have to start using this in mine. But anyway, um, I probably would have given it a five out of five stars if it wasn't for that hideous cologne that they included at the end. So anyway, I hope you guys are having a wonderful Valentine's Day. Um, I hope you're having a day. If you're not, get drunk like Amberlynn Reed on you now and just make a fool of yourself because, I mean, life's too short. So any of the information about the Chiba box is listed below. I love you guys so much, and I will talk to you later. Bye!